Welcome back to About Stories. This is Shruti. Friends, in our earlier webisode, we said a crow was secretly watching Chitagriva and his friends. Let's talk about him now. Vishnu Sharma started the story of the crow and the mouse. The story of the crow and the mouse. As the crow saw the flawless friendship of pigeons and the mouse, it thought that it should also have such a good friend like the mouse Hiranika and flew near him. As the crow was landing, its wings produced a lot of noise and blew air in the surroundings. This scared Hiranyaka. Oh my god! I think an eagle came here and it's better for me to stay inside. Thinking so, the mouse stayed inside the burrow out of fear. Standing at the entrance of the burrow, the crow said, Oh my dear mouse, Come outside, don't be afraid. Hearing so, the mouse came outside and asked, Hey, who are you? Why did you call me? My name is Lagupatana. I am a crow. I came here to be your friend. Kindly accept my friendship, requested the crow. Ha! You are my natural enemy. Believing you, will be like the deer which was about to lose its life by trusting the fox. I will tell you that story. It may ring you some bells. Saying so, Hiranyaka started the story of the cunning fox. The story of the cunning fox. Once upon a time, in a dense forest, there used to be a crow and a deer who were best friends. The crow and the deer used to help each other in gathering food. Their friendship was well known around the forest and everyone was happy with them. But there was a fox who was jealous of the crow and the deer's friendship. Moreover, he drools whenever he looks at the hefty deer as he wanted to kill it and have a feast for himself. As always, the crow accompanied the deer and the fox's sneaky idea did not work. One day, at any cost, he thought of killing the deer. He went near it when the crow was not around and said, Oh honey, I am overwhelmed to see your friendship with the crow. No one will get a true friend like you. So, I want you to be my friend. Will you be so? The poor deer believed the fox. The crow came to know about this and warned his friend by saying, My dear friend, do not listen to the fox. You should know its cunning nature. If you go with the fox, you will be deceived in the same way as the old eagle was deceived. I will tell you the story. Saying so, the crow tried to enlighten his friend. We will talk about the story of an old eagle and who deceived him in our next episode. Hope you like this episode. Do follow our upcoming videos. Do not forget to like, share and subscribe to our channel as it really encourages us to do more videos. Thank you so much for watching. Take care, bye and namaste.